Thanks, Will. Law enforcement agencies across the state are joining forces this month in an attempt to lower the number of fatal crashes involving pedestrians. Traffic reporter Brian Hoffman has a look at the pedestrian safety program. Law enforcement, including the Nevada Highway Patrol, Reno and Sparks Police Departments and the Washoe County Sheriff's Office, are putting more units on the road looking for very specific trends. DUI, distracted driving, uh, seatbelt usage, speeding, and pedestrian enforcement, which is what we're doing here today. This joining forces campaign goes on until the end of the month with a focus on behavior that endangers pedestrians. And really the goal of the program is to save lives uh, by promoting awareness uh, with the public of the dangers of making poor choices while driving. But it's not just drivers that law enforcement is stopping. It splits up about 50-50, where about 50% of the time it's somebody driving a vehicle and about 50% of the time the fault lays with the pedestrian. Officials ask that you slow down near intersections, yield to pedestrians, and avoid passing vehicles that are stopped. But they have tips for those of you walking around town, too. A lot of our uh, fatalities happen at night, uh, so we are asking folks to wear something reflective and understand that drivers cannot always see you. RPD says this program is less about issuing citations, rather more about education and about reducing the risk of deaths on the road. A perfect day for us is when these guys come back and say, boss, everybody was obeying the law, we couldn't issue any traffic citations, and our pedestrians were safe, our drivers were safe, and everybody gets home safe at the end of the night. It's a sentiment several people we spoke to agree with. It's a good idea that we're doing this, and hopefully it'll, it'll help down, cut down on some of uh, the risks that people are taking. So whether you plan on taking a drive on Nevada roads or heading out on foot, law enforcement wants to remind you to always use proper safety procedures, like looking both ways and making eye contact with a pedestrian or driver before using the crosswalk. Covering the story, Brian Hoffman, 2 News. And the pedestrian safety campaign will run through March 31st. It's funded by the Nevada Department of Public Safety.